What's up guys, I'm Claymore and today I'm bringing you another art challenge that I'm calling right hand versus left hand. And for this I decided to draw a tiger so I'm going to be starting on the right side of its face with my right hand and then once we get through that I will be trying to mirror that as best as I can with my left hand. So let's go ahead and hop right into it. So for this image, I was thinking I wanted to do more of a black and white, almost traditional style piece with a actual brush that is designed to look like a pencil. So I go through with what I would normally do for a sketch like this and I, I block out the major shapes and then I start to just add in my values and then slowly as I add in the shadows that really defines my fine details. I make sure to take my time with the texture of the fur because I wanted it to feel very organic and natural. And usually to achieve an effect like that, it's just patience and determination. And now my right hand side is done and I'm pretty happy with how it's coming along and I'm kind of anxious to get started on the left handed side. I know after that amount of effort my right hand is actually pretty sore and I can only imagine what it's going to be like on my left hand which has never drawn before. I have never used my left hand for drawing and I can't even write with my left hand. There's a lot of little moments of finesse with the fur and some of the more subtle cross hatching that I don't think I'm gonna be able to achieve on my left side. I'm not ambidextrous by any means, but I'm gonna be giving it my all and spending a few hours working on the left side. Let's get into it. 
For the left side, I just take a look at the proportions that I had already achieved and I start to fill those in with some very light lines and then I jump straight into the darker values working on my heavy shadows and knowing that I'll eventually get to my gradients and things like that. Now my pace for this is agonizingly slow but I know I need to do that in order to get some kind of resemblance of detail on this side. Now from afar, this may actually come together quite nice, but it really loses that uh, that fine detail as soon as you get up close. You can really tell that the left side is a little bit more scribbly and where the right side is a little bit more focused and precise. And with that, both sides of this image are done, and I can't believe I drew half of that with my left hand. Of course, when you zoom in, it kind of falls apart. You can definitely see that there's the lack of precision on the left side. I wanted to show that someone who's never drawn with their left hand, given enough patience and perseverance, you can actually do something halfway decent. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I hope you guys accept the right hand versus left hand challenge. And until next time, have a good one. Thanks for watching, guys. If you like this video, then don't forget to leave a like and subscribe if you want to see more. If you want to come watch me live, then you can join me on my Twitch channel. You can also follow me on my Twitter to chat and get frequent updates. So until next time, have a good one.